Hello everyone and welcome to our first war victory after the new update. So this is the clan that faced Oregon Ducks and they're a pretty nice clan. I visited there after the war. So this one is our win number 170 and they had 144 wins. So let's see the statistics for this war. So we got 18 free stars, 16 two stars, while they got 6 free stars and basically our statistics are a bit better and we won it so this is what they've done to us to start most of our Town Hall 10s and all of the rest of like 99% of the Town Hall 9s were two start and I think they three start only only two Town Hall 9s and a bit in the bottom the Town Hall 8. We on the other hand, and I'm gonna grab it, had some bad luck with that new AI. People are, did not adjust yet to the new AI and we're having trouble. Notice this 98% on, on their number 1, 92%, 98%, that was 59% but never mind. So to start their top Town Hall 9s and we're gonna see both of those attacks. In this war recap, and let's see over here 90%, 90%, some 3 stars, 94%, another 3 star, 99%, and you can see that we're, we were pretty unlucky 96%. So many, so many attacks failed with that new AI, and we were unlucky on this one 95% again, so. Here are the three stars. I think that most of them are three stars. Ninety six and again a ninety nine. That that's just crazy. We had so many fails, and I think I might make make a separate video with all those ninety plus attacks, the ones that were good, and maybe we can see why they failed. So let me know in the comments if that's something that you want. Let's start seeing the attack from the bottom to the top so you will stay interested to watch it until the end so this is the first attack and as you can see the air sweeper is in a pretty bad location and it's a level 1 air sweeper so as you can see the, the level 1 air sweeper is really not a big deal especially if it's in a, in a pretty bad location like, like this one so this video is just for demonstration of something else not the air sweeper I'm gonna zoom over here and watch the lava pups. There will be lots of lava, lava pups in the area and notice that they're not, they're not going for the queen at all. One balloon just fell on the queen and it lost, lost some health and notice all those lava pups over here. They don't even bother about the queen and only now they bother about the queen but it's too late. The queen fo focus on the lava pups and kill them and notice this attack would end very bad if it was a higher level queen. That's only a level 4 queen, so those balloons took her out. But that attack would end up really bad in any other situation where, where the queen is higher level. So he got the 3 stars, but that would fail in any other case. So the next attack is gonna be by the hammer and it's gonna be a lava attack. So Quattro Lava Loon you attack. Quattro Lava Loon, no minions here, and notice that he uses that against the side of the sweeper. That sweeper defends this area and he's just going from the other side so you should take notes about with those attacks about how you should defend the base and notice that the lava pops aren't really targeting that queen some of them do target because they were pretty close and they got the queen but I don't know that new AI artificial intelligence for the ones who don't know totally changed the game about the queen you can just run Quattro Lava Loon attacks or Penta Lava Loon attacks without any thinking. It was, it was disabled 
by Supercell and you can't really run those attacks unless the heroes are really low level and and unless you're really lucky so basically you can't do those attacks again because it will fail and even on this one he barely he barely gets it with that queen getting the last wist tower so make sure you plan your attacks well and adjust to the new update so the next attack is gonna be by Diego notice that the air sweeper is in a pretty bad location and it doesn't matter in his attack because he's using hogs so three golems and this one pretty inter interesting combination usually people don't take three golems but in this case with the new AI Diego didn't want to risk it didn't want to risk his heroes dying too early so now he's dropping the lightning spell on the clan castle troops get the jump spell into the queen area and notice that two golems are still alive and he will be able to safely get to the queen and take her out so now the king is gonna go for the queen and then he can get the main hog attack in so it's gonna be a surgical hog attack about two to three hogs into each defense and the heal spell just in case there are bombs over there so no bombs but still nice healing for the hogs so one of the solution for that air sweeper is definitely using hogs many of in our clan already using hogs not me I don't like hog attacks that much but I'll definitely have to practice those I did use some in the past like few months ago I was doing some go hog attacks but I didn't do many of them so I definitely need more practice so great attack over here by Diego so the next attack is gonna be by Jasper on max defenses tunnel 9 and as a clan we pretty much decided attacking lower than usual just because of this update and that clan strategy definitely won this war for us and you should consider those things if your clan is having troubles in this war after after the updates I know that many have troubles with the new AI they're used to something and and different things happen because it's not really predictable what can happen with the queen with the heroes with the clan castle so you should pay attention to clan strategy Town Hall 9 should attack lower, Town Hall 10 should at least you star the Town Hall 10s and then leave an attack to get a Town Hall 9. It's much easier for, for a Town Hall 10 to 3 star a Town Hall 9, even a maxed one. So if the Town Hall 10s can leave some attacks for, for a Town Hall 9 attack, they should definitely do that. We even use a Town Hall 8 to two star at a high level town hall nine so one of our our guys done that and I think that the clan strategy strategy together with good attacks is the one that won the war because many including me in one of the attacks at least had really big troubles with that new AI and I failed one of the attacks and got three stars on the other one. I'll definitely post a video of this one as well. And I think that you should reconsider changing the clan strategy if you're having troubles as a clan. And I'm sure that you will get the wins. So the last one is gonna be by Chris. Pretty awesome attack. Notice that he doesn't have a king and he's three starring their top town hall nine with the queen only and it's not a maxed queen as well it's gonna be a goal of a loon attack there is no air sweeper in this base but I think that even an air sweeper is not going to stop Chris from 3 star and he got a 6 star in this war so pretty awesome war for him especially when many of us had troubles in this war so let's enjoy his attacks the other attack that he 3 starred was a goal of attack and there was an air sweeper in that base 
and I will show that in a separate video. It was also a feint wrong against a max defenses Town Hall 9. So this one is not only max defenses, even the walls are almost max. So pretty awesome attack. So notice that he gets two air defenses with his heroes and the golems, and now we can start the lava attack with only two air defenses left. And he's gonna wreck that base very nicely. Spells are used in a very nice location, getting down all, all those wheeze towers and arch towers, and he got more lava hounds than air defenses. And in in such a case, you don't have to take too many balloons to get that base down. And Chris done the, done that very nicely, releasing all the rest of the balloons that that are left. And great attack, really amazing attack, one of the best attacks in this war. Especially when many have so many troubles in this war. So that's it. I hope you enjoyed the, this war recap. If you did, hit the like and subscribe button. Comment on the video. Let me know what you think of this update and anything else. You can ask me questions if you want. I'll try answering all of them. And make sure you check out the Facebook page and the website. I know that many things are not relevant because of the air sweeper and the new and the new artificial intelligence but I'll definitely update with all the new stuff so make sure you stay tuned and that's it we'll see each other in the next video bye bye